coming up and on the next episode of Surviving Arion, Martel and Arion have gotten back together. And Arion is liking Martel's Instagram Inus Wine post. <laughs> Did I sound just like the show when they come back on? Yeah, did I sound just like them? Well, happy Friday, and thank you all for coming back. Hello to all of my cookie agents. Hello to all of my haters. Hello to everyone that's just stopping by, just trying to see what's what. I hope you enjoy. So today, yes, um, Coleslaw and um, Martel have apparently made up. Martel is back to eating double fudge ice cream sandwiches. Yes. And I'm sure we'll hear all about it in the next few days. So just about a month ago, um, Arianne said that she was done on August the 14th. And I made a video and it's dropped in the description below, you guys. Arianne made a um, post on Instagram, several posts stating that she was done, done with Martel. Well, well, look who's back together again. Reunited and it feels so fake. I'm sick of these two people here. I am sick of them. You know, I am. Martel, why don't you just marry this girl? Can you just marry her and y'all just go on with your trifling, toxic life? Because you just keep going back and forward into this girl life, lying to her, damaging her, you know, just ruining this girl. She has an opportunity and you just continue to come back and, and just taunt this girl and play with her because you know, you don't have no real intentions for her. You know, you don't, but she's the type. She loves you so much she will possibly let you do anything because as we've seen, she's let you call her a peasant. She's let you move on to the next woman and publicly embarrass her multiple times. Just marry this girl. That's what we, the people, want you to do. We want you to just marry her. And then my question is this for Sheree. Sheree, why don't you fire this man? Fire him. He can't even get his lines right. He can't get his lines of his role of being your supporting cast, being your fake relationship. You know, when it first came out that he was with Sheree, he was going against it. Like he forgot they had a conversation the night before. This is why Mel was tired of this. This is exactly why she was tired of this. Sheree, I think you should just let him go and just get a fill in, Martell. How about that? Yes, you can get a little, we can find a bald headed man, black man anywhere. We can just say his name is Martell. We don't have to put Martell in and we can get one that's going to do right. <laughs> get one that's going to do right because um, Arion, if they're not together, she ain't going to be liking his posts. And this girl has went on and did that. She want us all the people who watch Love and Marriage Huntsville to know that they back together. This is her game. This is what she do. Um, you know, because tricks are for kids, silly rabbit. And that's what this silly rabbit likes to do. She likes to come back. She likes to leave. She likes to say, oh, I'm going to end it all. Oh, I'm going over to TikTok. I'm just going to use my Instagram for business. I'm going to be serious. Then next thing you know, she got her son on there pulling out alcohol bottles, hitting her. Um, she got a daughter on there, you know, and you, she say she doesn't want to be dragged. She say that we are the weirdos, but who's the biggest weirdo? Because you continue to come back and mess with us. But you know, shout out to these two, because these two are the reason why my channel got monetized and I'm just going to keep it a buck. But um, I'm just getting really, really tired of this breakup to makeup crap that they do every month. You know, it's, it's just getting old. It's getting old and very tired. It's getting very tired, you know, other than me making the money. Like, it's just worsome. You, you know how you know that one couple that's just worsome and it's like, y'all just fade in the background. I want them to just fade, just fade. I don't want to hear nothing else about it. So I don't know what this means for Sheree when the upcoming season come on because she just, we just all saw the 
reunion for Real Housewives of Atlanta where Sheree was grinning from ear to ear like a Cheshire cat about this fool calling her. And he's making a fool out of her just like he did out of coleslaw right here. You know, he just constantly makes a fool out of women. That's what he specializes in. You know, but he didn't make a fool out of our girl Mel because uh, Mel got her stuff together. You know, she just can't be made a fool out of. We know that he has the issue. He has the problem. Martel wants the buffet. He wants to do whatever he wants to do, like a lot of men. You know, they want to have them a buffet and, you know, have a little bit of food over here, have a little bit over there and come back whenever they feel like it. And it's just, it's too much for me. And I'm really, really tired of this. And I wish he would just get with a grown woman. He say he he missed marriage, you know. Um, I wish he would get with a grown woman and get married and let us see that blossom. I wish they could just turn the show around. And if you can't turn the show around, turn the damn show off. We don't want to see it no more. This is not a good representation of black people. For the people over in UK and Canada, Switzerland, and Africa, you know, I don't want you guys to think this is truly how black Americans behave that are successful, black Americans that are educated, black Americans that are entrepreneurs. This is, uh uh, <laughs> this ain't it. This is not how we behave. We have more poise to ourselves. These people here are just doing anything for clout, doing anything for a dollar. And it's just sad that we have sellouts, but, you know, they're everywhere. But, um, you guys, make sure you like this video. Subscribe to this channel if you're not already subscribed. Share this video with someone that you think that would love my commentary. And also, um, check out that video that I did on August the 14th uh, in the description box of when Martel got fed up and he went on ahead and ended it with um, with Thang over here, Thing One. <laughs> and also, um, I just want to thank you all for you know, returning and supporting me. It means so much to me. And um, I'm, you know, I'm just, tell me in the comments below what you think he said to this girl to get her all giddy and going back and unblocking him and liking his posts. Um, also, get over and check out my Ines Wine video. I, I reviewed Ines Wine and I might give you a few things you can pair it up with. But I'm out and I will see all of my cookie agents and all the people in the background making all the noise. I'll see you guys later. Have a happy Friday and an even better weekend. Bye. Oh, no, I'm supposed to say um, thank you and you welcome. We out. <laughs>